Well, hello everyone, I'm doing a back-to-back -back episode of Sprung, just because I want something to upload. Uh, not tomorrow. Well, okay, so Sprung's going up on Thursday. Last episode of Sprung's going up on Thursday, uh, the uh, 21st. Then the next day should be Resident Evil, and then after that might be Sprung. Or maybe another Resident Evil, then Sprung, because I don't record it that much. But anyway, we're doing the Sting today. It's time to catch Connor in a lie. Prove that Connor is cheating on Kiki so she'll go on a date with you. Baby, let's do it up. Kiki's kind of cool. I mean, she's not, like, the best, but... Alright. You've been into Kiki for a long time, but she's always had a boyfriend. But now you have to prove... But now you have proof that her boyfriend's a complete cheating slime ball. Well, sort of. So, you saw Connor and Alex making out in the ski lift. Oh, God. But didn't Alex want to fucking go out with fucking, uh... Lucas? Lucas. Or at least you think he did. Uh, what's going on here? Oh, Alex, yeah, right. What's he just do? Is he just looking at her? Does that actually work? Any lady viewers, does just looking at you make you, like, want to, like, just make out with a guy? Honestly? I know I only have, like, two girls that watch this, but still. You can't chance it. You gotta tell her. I don't believe you, brat. Wait, what the fuck? I don't even remember what her voice was. I don't believe you, brat. No, it definitely wasn't that. You say Connor's cheating on me with Alex? Prove it. The only way I'm going to believe it is if I hear it from him. Call him now and make him admit it or I'll swear I'll hate you forever. Better not be lying to me. Just make sure you're absolutely quiet. Alright, so watch and learn, baby doll. Damn, you're cocky. Ooh, yeah. Alright, ring ring. <laughs> Hello? Hey, it's Brett! What's up, dude? Kano, it's the Brett Man. I swear, if anyone ever said Kayo, and I, I'd just, I'd, I'd hang up right there. All right, so hey, man, it's Brett. Brent, what the hell are you doing calling me? Checkpoint. Okay, that was a fast checkpoint. Um, I just wanted to see how those new skis were handling, boy. Listen, I have some girl trouble. No, I, yeah, let's do the skis. You're kidding, right? Is this normal calling customers? It's all. What? It's all part of our 10-point quality assurance plan. Oh my god, I think Friendly says one of those. I'm not calling for the store. I'm calling because I want to buy my own pair. That seems like legit. Oh, well, let me tell you. You couldn't handle these babies. The turn radius is way too small. You'd be spinning in circles. But, uh... It, uh doesn't that make turns easier? I don't know. You broken them in yet, bro? Let's try that. Hell yeah, I've been skiing every day this week. I wax them, dust them, carve and repeat. Hmm, Connor skied every day this week. Okay, so that's that's a possibility that he fucking sucked face with Alex on the lift. I'm sorry. I just have to get these little fucking sprung jitters out. Alright, let's see. Must be great to have some one-on-one -on -one time with the slopes. Hey, I never ski alone. Downhill isn't any fun if you're not racing with someone. Hmm, Connor never skis alone. So shorter skis are usually racing skis. Well, that's the only option we can fucking do right now, so... Let's do that. Dude, no wonder you got fired. A shorter ski means a quicker turn, which means all reaction and comp compensation time has to be faster and more finessed. These girls demand a different level of carving. You call your skis girls? Like, what the fuck? Um, so if you overcompensate on a right turn, you trash your right ankle, right? You've never skied before, have you? Your opposite foot does the work. It's the one lifting up, lifting your uphill ski. Hmm, the opposite foot does the turning. Why, why is that important, honestly? Why is that important? Hey, before you go, is there another, th wait. Yeah, hey, before you go, there was another, make it quick, Brent. See what else you can find out. Or, see what else you can find out, Brett. That's her new voice. I'm sorry if it changed, but oh yeah, checkpoint. But I love fucking seeing. Oh my god. All right. Um. I just wanted to see how those new skis were. She's having some girl trouble. We should go skiing sometime, you and me. He's not gonna care about me. I was having some girl trouble and thought maybe you could give me some advice. <laughs> yeah, I bet you are. I don't know why you think I'd help you though. Because you're a nice guy. No. Um. No. 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 
Because you want to, because you want to shock the world one day by not being a complete douche for five seconds. Listen, I ain't looking to swipe a stake from you. I just want you to throw me a bone. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm not without com compassion. I'll help the weak and dying when they're in need. What do you want to know? Um, what do I want to know? Do you know anybody who's in me? <laughs> Actually, yeah. I thought I heard nerd girl was into you. Take what you can get, man. Carpe nerdum. Oh wow, what a fucking awesome guy. Alright. Are you talking about are you talking about Alex? Are you talking about Alex? A hot little number like that? Give me a break. Hmm, so Connor does admit that Alex is hot. What I really want is dirt, boy. Actually, yeah, I really do want dirt. Who are some of the hottest girls? Yeah, I want dirt. If you want dirt, check under your fingernails. No, I'm just kidding. What do you want to know? I heard, a, uh, I heard a certain girl on the mountain is a little wild on the dance. Oh, gets a little wild. I'm sorry. I heard a specific female specimen is a drop-dead awesome kisser. I think I know who you're talking about. Um... Yeah, Alex, right? Yeah, let's just call Alex. That's what we're gonna find. <laughs> but it's only what I heard. Who knows for sure, right? Damn! So Alex has a reputation for being a good kisser. Who are some of the hottest girls, Connor? Can you please tell me? Why would you care who I thought was hot? Isn't there something you can figure out for yourself? Uh, well, maybe, but, you know, I just... Just wanted to frame a comparison is all. It's, it's all I wanted, man! Then buy a magazine! Jeez! Okay, you're an asshole, man. Oh, jeez, there's another reason I wanted to talk to you. I can't wait to hear what it is. Good, keep, good, keep him talking. Another checkpoint? Oh my god! What is this? This is insanity! Uh, blah, 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 blah. Oh yeah, checkpoint, I'm sorry. I was just kind of spacing out there. Alright, um, I'm pretty sure we did these options already. We should, we should go skiing some time. Nope, 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 nope. We should go skiing some time, you and me. <laughs> That's cute, Brett, but no thanks, Paco. Why not, bro? That's cool. You're scared, I understand. Yeah, bitch. Calling you out. Why would you even try to intimidate me? I can name five skiers off the top of my head who could wax you on the slopes. Um, well, that may be, Connor. But, uh, I think you're a little douche. Let's see. Yeah, but none of them are you, so what does it matter? Ooh, that might be good. I can name five presidents, what's your point? Do it then, I dare you. Well, me, obviously, and Elliot. Your buddy Lucas thrashes way harder than you do. Alex is pretty awesome, you'd be no contest for her. And let's see, ah, oh, yes, a shaved monkey. Hmm, Alex is a good skier, he takes- He doesn't ski alone, she's got a reputation for a good kisser. Hmm, it's all coming together here. Alright, and I suppose you have more important people to to tackle runs with? Is that... I can't stand it. This music is so fucking insane, dude. Yeah, let's do that. As a matter of fact, I do have a more esteemed circle that I race with. Okay, um, I guess that would make you the circle jerks. <gasps> oh my god, golden line material. That might be good. No, um... I don't know. I don't know, and don't know. And who is that? Or is it whom? It's whom. And if you must know, I tend to ski with Elliot and Sean, mostly. Isn't Sean... Elliot and Sean... Isn't Sean Becky's ex-boyfriend? Uh, should we just keep him on the phone? Because, I mean, we didn't really get anything. Yeah, wait, 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 one more thing. What? Keep getting info and you'll nail him. Um, I mean, if, if that is, he really cheated on me. That wasn't her voice at all that it was at the beginning of the video. So anyway, I just noticed that I fucked that up. We get another fucking checkpoint. Is this going to go on for much longer? Because I think it is. I'm just glad I haven't messed up yet. All right, so I just wanted to see how those new skis were handling. What the fuck? Um, let's see what we didn't do. We should go skiing sometime. Oh, no reason. I just wanted to chat. I don't want to call him out. What could we possibly have to talk about, Brett? Um, uh, any good parties lately? 
Oh, now I understand. You're just trying to get invited to the rap party for Elliot's photo shoot. Uh, well, actually, I might be invited because I actually work for him, and I am an employee of the month, so, I mean, that might not be still bad. Actually, this is the first I've heard of it, but it actually sounds cool. Yep, you got me. I don't want to sound like some fucking douche. You know, like you haven't seen all the models walking around town, and you didn't know that Elliot was a model scout? Uh, no, I honestly didn't. <laughs> well, then that explains why you don't get invited to parties now, doesn't it? Dude, you're a spoiled fucking punk, honestly. Like, but do you think I can get invited to one of those? Yeah, I guess it does. Um, <laughs> yeah. Huh, no dice, pal. This party's strictly for photographers, models, and close friends only. And you're not any of those. I just took some pictures for yearbook once. Does that count? It, I definitely don't think it does. Um, I could be a model. I just don't apply myself. <laughs> you, a model? Yeah, for life preservers, maybe. Who are you kidding? Ah, you got me because I wear a vest, you fucker. Ooh, excuse me. Alright, so... I bet Elliot would flip if I could... I bet Elliot would flip if he could take pictures of me. You're right, I was just joking anyway, yeah. Hey, Elliot's been, s been spending 12 hours every day this week shooting gorgeous models from all over the world. Why the hell would he want to waste precious minutes on you? I mean, Elliot worked all day today. Okay. Anything else you want to chat about, Poser McPose Pose? This guy literally has like the worst fucking insults ever. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I heard you own Sanctuary. What's the deal with that? Are there any good parties? No, we just did that. Yeah, you must have heard real insider information to get that little nugget. No, I don't have majority ownership in Sanctuary. I just run the place and reap the benefits. Why? You looking for a job? Uh, maybe. Um, I think you know that I am. I think, wait, I think you know that I am. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, right. Sorry, I don't work for Megalomaniacs. No, thanks. I'd rather just dance there. Well, I'm not even sure if I'm into that idea. It's a pretty high-class venue. I'd have to fire my doorman if he let you in looking the way you usually do. Alright, so you're an asshole, and you can go fuck yourself. But you should see me out on the dance floor. My moves make up for everything. Yeah, well, fill out your pink slip because there's no doorman here, boy. Huh, um. Can we go up? Yeah, it's kind of hard for me to be a classy guy. Oh, I just skipped. Did I just skip this one? Yeah, it's kind of hard for me to be a classy guy who's dressed like a pirate. Ooh, Golden Line! Hey, sweet. I think Golden Line's up the butt today. You see the golden line? Yeah, 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 pirate, yeah. What? The shirt is from Italy and costs more than you do! Sean thought it was cool. Yeah, Sean, Sean's a fucking loser, though, so... Yeah, um... Yeah, what's his... Yeah, what's his deal? Nothing, he's just a little bit of a, a lunk at his all. Like the other night, the dude's on a break for five minutes and manages to twist his ankle dancing. Sean twisted his ankle so he couldn't be skiing, so that means he'd have to fucking ski with Kiki. Er, I'm sorry, Alex. I I'm fucking trying to fucking get this girl. Uh, yeah. Serves a bastard right. Guess I wish I could have been there to hear the snap. Oh my god, Brett, that's morbid. Which ankle? Uh, the left one? Yeah, because now he wears that lame brace, even when he skis. Okay, so maybe he still can ski. Friggin' hilarious. Hmm, the left ankle. Does this conclude our little chat, or do you have something else in, to mindlessly blather about? Um, I think we do have some more things to blather about, bro. Right, let's see here. Parties. We did that other one, the sanctuary. I don't know a whole lot of people on the mountain, and I thought we could be friends. Oh, I'm sorry. You must have me confused for some kind of non-profit lo loser shelter like Habitat for the Hopeless. Bite me, you cock. Alright, but anyway, um... Look, if you can't take a joke, I mean, come on, you fucking poser. Yeah, you were really joking, whatever, dweeb. That's a horse's vagina, from what I hear. Alright, so, um... I saw you kissing her, boy. Okay, okay, so I lied. I have a real reason for calling you. No, I... That's what, what? I don't know what you think you saw, but I did not hook up with Alex. And I swear to God, if you start telling people, I will end you. 
Oh, shit. So he's gonna end us? No, um... Uh... Look, I know I could have been mistaken. I just wanted to see if there was an explanation for it, that's all. Listen, it couldn't have been me because I was... I wasn't even on that ski lift. Um, okay. Wait, yeah, wait, 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 wait. But... You said, you said you were skiing every day this week, right? Is that... Or you said this, you ride the ski lift all the time. Is that which one? Which one would we do? Um, yeah, let's say you're skiing every day this week. So what? Maybe I was by myself or something. Away, anyway, away from her. But you said you never skied alone. Yeah, but that doesn't mean I was with Alex. Yeah, but Elliot was busy, and Sean fucking twisted his ankle. So you were skiing with Sean or Elliot, like you said? Yeah, I must have been skiing with Elliot. But you said Elliot has been busy for 12 hours with photo shoots. Well, then it must have been Sean! But you said he hurt his fucking ankle. But we stuck most into the Blue Cat Paw trails and we almost we almost had all right turns. Okay. But Wait. Did it say your opposite foot does the turning? Oh, But it was his left ankle, so right turns would have been weak. Oh, wait, that's right. I, I wasn't with Sean today. Oh, right. I, I did see Alex briefly uh, this afternoon. But she was messing around on the bunny trail for the most of the day, so it wouldn't have been me on the ski lift. Okay, bunny trail? Alright. But you said... Oh, wait, 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 wait. So you admit that Alex is messing around. In fact, contains not a single bunny... But you said Alex was an awesome skier. Why would she be on the bunny hill? We're breaking this guy's balls. Oh, wait! Uh, may maybe there was somebody else. That's right. Alex and I shared a lift up to different runs, but it was completely innocent. Huh. Okay. And you did say she was attractive, though, didn't you? Yeah, I mean, of course she's attractive. It doesn't take a rocket scientist to see that. Alright, I think we're about to end this. And she does have an... And she does have that reputation for being an incredible kisser. Buddy, you've got no idea. Connor, you jerk! I'm breaking up with you, you mongoloid pirate oaf! I never want to see you again! <laughs> what? I hate you! Look at Brett's face! Oh my god, that's golden right there. This... Right here, ladies and gentlemen, may or may not be my new fucking profile image. This is too good. This is too good. I'm screen capturing this. Oh my fucking god. That's too fucking good. Oh my god. Alright, anyway, so that's that's it, I believe, for this episode of Let's Play Sprung. Oh, no, not yet. Not yet. She hangs up. Wow, she looks devastating. Maybe this wasn't a good idea. It could take her weeks to get over this. Maybe even months. Or maybe if you work that Brett charm, just a couple of minutes. Kiki. You want a date? No. Oh. You want a date? Uh, sure. Cool. Awesome. Alright, that was fast. Look at that Brett goofy face charm. Right, I, the voice cracked. But anyway, let's continue just in case we got items. I would like to save. Doesn't look like we got items. Alright, so anyway. Ooh, I'm, I'm going to be doing this one next time. I'm not going to be doing it... I'm not going to be recording a third video, so... Next time on Sprung, we're going to be doing the Hot Tub Rub. That sounds like a minigame in Mario Party or something. So yeah, join me next time for the Hot Tub Rub. It sounds pretty seductive.